Yes, 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 what's up gang, if you're joining me, uh, back into hectic mode, back again, buying flights, day before travelling, flying tomorrow to go to Saudi Arabia, to go, uh, yeah, capture Usyk fight, this isn't showing on this thing, like, hell, I'm just like, yeah, working through errors, working through stuff, but, uh, trying to get some press t-shirts made, trying to get some, yes, yeah, I gotta get some oud while I'm out there, gotta get some dates while I'm out there, gonna do a bit of shopping, anyways, we're gonna be out in Saudi Arabia for the first time, so it's gonna be experience, I hope you guys are excited, I am, might bring the America shirt, it's gonna be hot as f out there, of course we're going to the to Arab land, the desert, Uh, yeah, y'all are tuned in for a special one, so yeah, I'll be giving y'all updates throughout the day as I, A, I'm trying to get, a, trying to design a special Usyk t-shirt for print today, so they're staying in the payment by two, so I'm probably going to pay by three and hope that they didn't turn it around in two hours. Many hours later. What's up gang, the time is now 5.30, um, <clears throat> I have an hour exactly, basically, to get my tush ready so gonna eat got clean got a pack got do a whole load yeah it took forever to go get the the gums however we're now in the game the media boys we're here we're gonna be media in we're gonna be a fishy we're gonna be we're gonna be there it's gonna be lit the boys and girls my flight from here for terminal four is at 10 oh five it's now nine 7.25 right now I'm never left so late I just packed the bag, I just threw everything in the bag and was like fuck it whatever I got, I got So the time is now 8 o'clock I have 1 hour and 4 minutes until it's an hour until my train uh, flight. I hope that I have a boarding pass. I mean, technically I should be good. Technically I should be good. Technically I should be alright. This is the closest I've ever cut it. Like, I think ever. Um, definitely for Heathrow. Definitely for long haul, apart from, you know what I'm saying, like missing a couple of flights, which out of my control but yeah I'm fucking shattered I've had a long day I barely slept again ran around basically didn't get much done but got my flyers printed got my little leaflets printed got my uh, custom merch done I got packed I guess like I just repacked a bit while I was I literally just threw everything in the suitcase. I was just like bang bang, okay, this, 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 this. Like I thankfully I have like a semi-system and things in my office are like at least reasonably organized to the point that like you know I have my cable box, I have this box, I have the power box, so I just quickly look in that box, do anything? No. But boom boom. So I just look through all the boxes. Then I just made sure that Everything I wanted in there was taken. So I hope there was nothing left out lying around in some other drawer somewhere unorganized. Maybe I forgot something, maybe I didn't think about something, but I've got the bare necessities definitely to make a shoot happen. I was thinking not to bring this bag. I'm, I'm crazy, I definitely need this bag. And it looks good. Only thing is I did not bring, look, like, so I got the shoes and I got the Crocs in this, but I don't have, uh, I don't have any jumper or anything like that. Also, you know, I just want to have my options covered in case I get invited to some restaurant or some shit. I, did, I don't have a brush for my hair. That is one thing I did forget to bring. Get my documents in order. I have my, my boarding pass, you know. When you're traveling, when you're going to the airport, make sure you have the boarding pass, right? Any visas, you know, you want that to be easy. Like, you know, you arrive and then they're like, so what, what's your visa and you're like but I downloaded it you 
for rows 2, terminal 3 and terminal 4. It's now half uh, 8. I'm at Heathrow on this fucking platform. The next train is uh, ready to depart apparently. We're here. Terminal 4 only, let's go. I want to be Terminal 4 only, baby. Just like that. Put out. I hate that. Following someone and then it, their shit. Fucking. I was like, let me follow the TFL, man. His shit's not gonna. Not gonna. Decline. His shit declined. I'm like, ah! I should be good, should be good. 8.44. Fuck, you know. <laughs> Cutting it tight. I should be checked in. So where do I go? I'm here at if Terminal 4, baby. I hope I'm going to find fucking Terminal. I beg. So the English fans are already here. I keep from making noise. In the route. Let's see if they're going to be singing in roughly 30 hours or so. The, the judge will be out. Oh my god, this bitch. Horrible. Oh, Jesus Christ. Boom. Here, yeah, we made a flight. So, I don't know, like Bagsy or whatever his name is from Manchester, that random rapper that pulled up with his girl. She was cute. But that guy's way hot. But yeah, I pulled up like a big man. I don't know, they can, it's interesting when you see someone that obviously you recognize their face from somewhere. Obviously, I have heard him like rap before, even though I'm usually whatever. But yeah, no, the way he conducted himself was like this shifty kind of mannerism. So, okay, yeah. So, yeah, it was just strange. Anyways, I asked for a business class upgrade, but they said no. I said yes, they were like, yeah, yeah, put in the business, but they didn't, they didn't pass me. But, anyways, here we go. We're in the game. Here we go, I'm fucking shy at the We headed. أيها السيدات والسادة أسعد الله مساءكم بكل خير معكم طيار مساعد اسمي طارق بخش ومعي بارين بيبي هنا نروح نحن 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 Lights out here for a while, anyways. It's 6 30 in the morning. It looks like it's locked for time being. That's a fun little play place. Uh, to everybody in the spot, transfers. Oh, I'm going to transfer here. Very cool. Well, I need to give you a passport or. Where are you going? Riyadh? Yeah, I just I just get on the plane with the tickets. That's that's, that's it, right? right? Thank you, brother. Yeah. Usyk or Fury? Us, you watching the boxing? Boxing? Yes. Who? 
I don't know. Ukraine, I England. You went over there. In Ukraine. Ukraine. Yeah. All the best. Yeah, thank you, Baba. So now we're gonna watch it. Yeah, you are watching now. All the best. <laughs> thank you, Baba. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Tomorrow, uh, two days. <laughs> uh, actually, not everywhere in the whole world watches it, but I mean, like, it's a big fan. I don't know, like, I am in my head, it's heavyweight unifying, it's the biggest first and business class now. So, yeah, just uh, in. I forget where I am, Bahrain or wherever it is, but. but fuck it in hell, mate. There's a WH Smith here. This Camden Food Company in this airport in Bahrain. And there's a Boots. So, yeah, I mean, like, when you're doing your shoplifting in the UK, don't feel too bad. Oh, shawarma. I want a shawarma. Oh. But a chicken, chicken biryani and a drink. Like the BHD is quite, um, the currency conversion works out quite strongly in their number. People people get confused that they think that just because, oh, it's one pound to like, so sorry, say for example, one BHD is going to be like two pounds, so people are going to be like, ah, oh, so the currency is stronger. Yeah, it's two pounds. That's, doesn't, that's not what strong means. People conflate strong, meaning you can transfer a lot of it. doesn't mean that the currency is strong. doesn't mean that how much purchasing power can you buy with that currency, you know? It doesn't mean like you work the same job or you're going to get one Bahrain dollar for every pound you get in the UK. We know that salaries in the States or Norway or whatever it is, it's way higher anyways. I want a shawarma, bro. I think I want an airport shawarma, bro. There's a Baskin Robbins. Sir, payment very last straight left side corner. Thank you. So, Bahrain Airport, very expensive. Oh, this is Pepsi. Oh, look at that. Sponsored by Pepsi. Aquafina. The juice was like five pounds. Sort of five up. Five sips of this. We tried some shawarma on the roof. There's gold. Here we are, which cost £10. This is £10. That's £10. This is actually £4. Yeah. Bahrain is expensive. At least the airport. Pretty awful. I was hoping it might be fresh because it's in the morning. But it tastes the opposite of fresh. Should we go KFC? For sure. Oh well, I'm try something. I don't know how I'm. I don't know if it's like food poisoning. I don't know if I'm food poisoning myself right now. Honestly, I don't think it's like the flavors that are off. I think it's the meat that's off. I'm gonna stop eating. Maybe it's like because it's six in the morning, seven in the morning. They haven't been through like yesterday's stock or whatever. I mean, I hit the fries, but that's sure I'm already. I don't want to be sick. I ain't bring no charcoal on my food with me. Like, activate charcoal is great when you've got stomach problems. Up, gang, yeah, I'm just at the airport. Um, filmed a little video thinking about how to get which e sim to get. Um, the little price comparison between the different popular apps. Um, been pretty really fun actually, I'm tired as hell. Yeah, I really wish I had a t-shirt going into to, to tonight. Uh, like an Usyk t-shirt, I don't. I don't think I'm gonna do it. I like, it's one of my ideas, but we've got these uh, flyers which I've made about supporting the film I'm working on. Do you know what I'm saying? I don't know. If you saw this flyer, would you be like, what the hell is this? Like, maybe check it out. Um, but yeah, I just did it like simple. It's about Ukraine. Put the title of the movie there. It's a working title, but whatever. I need to put something down. Baba Vanga, it's kind of cool. Just a call to action, and then obviously a link where to find the thing. 
and our main character is on the back. But let me, um, yeah, let me, I'm tired. Flight is in one hour now, so time is ticking. Been here for like two, I guess. Yeah, I've been here for two hours since we landed, so. It's easy on the way back, I've got a six hour stop here. It's light work, especially with the charges and stuff. Um, I guess I know now where to come post up. Um, I need to make myself a Usyk email, email myself so it looks like that I'm coming and I've been invited by Usyk. So I'm going to do that now. I'm ready, do you know what I'm saying? I'm ready. But uh, yeah, uh, most of these pizza look decent. I should have got a, I should have got a pizza or something because shawarma was not the one, bro. That was a, a fucking diarrhea in a, in a fucking sandwich made in a wrap. But, my, my alarm's ringing, so the gate has been posted. Um, I'm gonna do 15 more minutes of this. And uh, yeah, I've just backed up some some files and stuff, so I'm just gonna do a bit more backing up and moving, and then, yeah, I'm gonna go here off flight. <laughs> Guys, I don't feel too good after that show, I'm at all. I ain't like shit. Whoa, mate, I'm gonna find a toilet, bus of shit. The only drugs I've, I've got with me are codeine. Please. Oh, this is a secure 